Welcome to Bridge24. This is an introduction video to give you an idea of the interface and its functionality. Uh, this video is using a SANA connector uh, as the example, but you can connect to the other applications here and they pretty much have the same functionalities uh, throughout with minor differences. From the left panel are your predefined filters, so tasks that are assigned to different users by team here, uh, all tasks from all projects. Uh, as well as the project list and in the case here the, 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 the tags and you can create your own filters so using your own filters you may want to also include using completed tasks by default it's only incomplete tasks so to use here to uh, add all your tasks including completed tasks and other filters and save your filter in the grid when you return data is, is comes to the grid your grid here shows all the information you're able to actually add more columns remove the columns and as well add the custom fields if they're available in your, for example, in this account, there's custom fields from Asana, have this little symbol here. You can also modify the headers and where the uh, field shows up. Also in the grid, you're able to group. So you can group this, for example, by section. And then in each section, you can group by assignee. And you're able to see the tasks in those different sections. And you can also save these different views of the information. Also available is a calendar view of this information where you can change the date and uh, time of the tasks. A board view as well that you can use to, in a board method, from any of these views you can click on any task, bring up the edit panel and edit the information in the grid or in the task. as well you can export. An export dialog comes up, you can click the settings for the format, which view you'd like to use, and in case of Asana where there's subtasks, you can export subtasks and then export it to Excel. Also you can, from a filtered view, any information that is contextually available here, you're able to create charts for the displayed tasks, and from these charts you're able to change position, you can view and remove the and add the legend, you can actually dynamically close and open sections in from the legend and clicking on any segment will bring up the task list which you can also click and edit directly or open this in the grid. The other option is to print it in PDF, in this case I'm going to print the PDF with tasks. So here's our PDF that we can now download or print directly. As well, there's a reports area. These are predefined reports. We will be expanding this uh, in the future. For right now, it's just a single level uh, report. For example, I want all tasks of the filtered information that I have here by assignee. And here's our task list ready to print. The last section here is history. We're able to go to the history and get a, for all the tasks that were available, all the different events that are occurring on this task for the last seven days. And for example here, I can do for the last 90 days. And I can search for tasks dynamically. And again, this information can be exported. Help is always available at the top right. All the information, videos, and help, and how to contact us is available here, as well as to upgrade to your premium account to unlock the limitations.